In this video, I'll explain the procedure to remove the plot stamp which you normally get when you take a plot using the student version of AutoCAD. Before exploring the topic, I request all of you to subscribe to my YouTube channel SabirCAD if you haven't subscribed already and hit the bell icon to get instant updates on my future video uploads. Thank you. Now I'm using the student version of AutoCAD 2021. Now let's go for a plot. So I'll click on the application button, print. I'll choose DWG to PDF as the printer. Then I'll choose the paper size as A4. Then I'll center the plot. Then the area to be plotted, I'll choose using a standard window. Then I'll preview the plot. Now you can see that there is plot stamp. That is, at the borders of the plot, you can see produced by an Autodesk student version stamp appearing. Now I'll right click exit from this. Now how will you remove this plot stamp? I'll show you the most commonly used method that is saving this drawing in DXF format and opening the DXF drawing then going for a print. But this procedure will not work in the latest releases of AutoCAD. DXF stands for Drawing Exchange File Format and it is developed by Autodesk company who has actually developed AutoCAD software in 1982. You can save a drawing file in DWG or in DXF format. DXF is an exact replica of DWG because of which you will be able to open this DXF file in other applications to perform various activities such as uh, structural design, analysis, etc. Anyways, let's save this drawing file in DXF format. So I'll click on application button and save as. You are already aware that you can save an AutoCAD drawing file in older versions of DWG format. Similarly, you can also save a DXF file in the older versions. I'll save it in AutoCAD 2013 DXF format because I would like to open this DXF in an older release of AutoCAD. I'll keep it on the desktop. The file name is Sab House Plan. Just save. Next, I'll open the DXF file in an older release of AutoCAD, which is AutoCAD 2016 version. So I'll click on application button, open. Then I'll choose DXF as the file type. I'll select the file which is kept on the desktop and open. I'll click on application button again, print, plot. I'll select PDF as the printer, A4 as the paper size. And I'll choose the area to be plotted using a standard window like this. Then I'll center the plot, then preview the plot. Now you can see that there is no plot stamp in the preview as well as in the print. So if you right click and plot, and I'll keep this PDF plot on the desktop. Now even from the print, the plot stamp is removed. But as you have seen in this demonstration, this method is no longer applicable in the recent releases of AutoCAD. So how will you remove plot stamp from the latest release of AutoCAD? Now I'm going to suggest you a practical solution for this, but for this we need one more software. Let's see the procedure. Now let's take a short break. I'm happy to inform you that I've got another YouTube channel which deals with technological tips. The name of the channel is SAP Tech TV. I have provided link at the comment section of this video. Please visit that channel and subscribe to it. You will be getting a number of technological tips from that channel which will be beneficial in your day to day life. For example, you can learn techniques to copy huge file to pen drives and removing password from a PDF file which is already password protected. The best YouTube downloader app. The technique to send file from a mobile phone to a laptop or to a PC through Wi-Fi. You can learn such things from that channel. So don't forget to visit and subscribe. Thank you so much. I have opened the same drawing file in AutoCAD 2021 and I'm going to give a plot. So I'll click on print. I'll select the printer as DWG to PDF and the paper size as A4 and I'll use a standard window to plot. Now you can preview it. Now there is plot stamp. 
I'll give OK. Then I'll keep it on the desktop. We have created a file with the same name already. I'll override that file. OK, so this is a PDF file. Next, I'll minimize AutoCAD and I'll open the PDF file in Adobe Photoshop software. You know that Photoshop is a well-known image processing and photo editing application. I have opened Adobe Photoshop software. Next, I'll open the PDF file here. So I'll go to File, Open. Then I'll select the PDF file and open. You can see the preview of it here. Next, I'll specify the paper size. You know the dimensions of A4 size paper is 21 by 29.7 centimeters. So width I'll give 21 and height is 29.7 and I'll give OK. So this is an A4 size paper onto which the drawing is placed. Next I'll delete this plot stamp. I'll click on the rectangular selection tool. Make sure that Add to Selection button is turned on. Then I'll select the first plot stamp and second one, third one and the fourth one. Since Add to Selection is turned on, all the previous selections will be retained. Next I'll hit the Delete button of the keyboard to get rid of it. Next I'll deselect by pressing Ctrl D. You can darken the figure little more before you save it. So I'll click on the image, adjustments, levels, then this pointer, you can move all the way rightward to make it little more dark. Okay. Next you can save this file. So I'll click on file, save as, you can save it either as a PDF file or as a JPEG file. I'll save it as a PDF file, then save. Such a PDF is already existing. So I'll save it in a different name. Sab house plan changed. Then you can save it in any PDF standard. I'll save it in PDF 7 standard. Save as PDF, then give yes. Now the Sab house plan changed is created on the desktop. Let's open it and see it. It's a perfect drawing without the plot stamp. Hence this procedure can be used as a practical solution to remove the plot stamp. So that's all for now. Please hit the like button of this video if you liked it. Until I catch you with another interesting video, bye bye and take care. Thank you so much for your time.